Next, we will sew the shoulder pads. To do so, I will come over here to the library tab and double click on this hardware and trim folder. And scroll down, I will see the shoulder pad, double click on it to open. And we want to select this female shoulder pad for millimeter, double click on it. And we want to select this add and click on OK. And once again, click on OK. So if I click on the shoulder pad right here is on the right side, we're going to move that to the right side. So my key select that shoulder pad right there and then simply click and then move them to the right side. Then I'm going to my key select both of the shoulder pad and then bring them down here a little so it's closer for us to sew to the jacket. And next I'm going to my key select both the shoulder pad and then press on number two here. I'm going to simply click and then drag it in and drag it backward a little. So be sure the shoulder pad kind of place it in in a proper location. So click it to the front a little. All right, it looks pretty good. Now I'm going to come over here and then sew that shoulder pad. So let's simply move them close to each other a little here. So next we're going to sew the shoulder pad. To sew the shoulder pad, I will use the free sewing tool. We want to begin sewing roughly in the center here and then sew it backward. And then we sew that to the front here. The same right here. We want to begin sewing from the center and then to the back and then from the top shoulder here to down here. And after that, I'm going to come over here and then simulate. All right, so if you look at closely here, the shoulder pad kind of pokes through the jacket and that's okay. We're going to fix that. Let's stop the simulation for now. We will select the transform pattern tool and then click on this piece right here, just the front piece. Come to the property editor and we want to change the thickness to zero, okay? And then press return enter on the keyboard to confirm. Now let's simulate one more time here. And now the shoulder pad is fixed. Okay, let's stop the simulation and we want to double check to make sure. So simply come over here and change that texture here to translucent. So if we looked at the shoulder pad, now they are perfect and where they belong. Next, I'm going to come over here and then change that texture back to thick texture surface. And uh, let's simulate one more time here and then stop the simulation. 